I am working on some green bean casserole. Over here I've got some red potatoes that have about three more minutes before I need to take them off the heat. And this is going to be going in the oven, hopefully within that three minutes, so that I don't have any. So how do you make this casserole, or is it state secret? Uh, no, I just Googled it, to be honest with you. It's, um, it's supposed to be four cans of green beans, but I, I, I like a little bit more green bean in it than they wanted. So I add an extra can of green beans, and then you just have your cream of mushroom soup. You mix it up with some milk, and you put it in there, and you sort of mix it around together. And then on top, you add these. Actually, you have to wait to add those until like they've been cooking in the oven for just a little bit because you don't want those too crispy. So that's probably the only step that somebody could really mess up on this. At least that's what I think. Okay. So I have, I think, one more can of green beans to add. And then this will be done. Probably I'm not going to make that timer. It's probably going to have to simmer for just a little bit longer, but that's going to be okay. How do you like my apron? Festive. Fest well, it's festive for any time of year. Yes. It's strawberry shortcake. Oh. Uh, who's he? <sighs> I know you're joking. Now, do I think that you know that much about strawberry shortcake? Probably not, but I'm pretty sure that you at least know that she's female. All right. One minute left. Yeah, I don't think I'm gonna make that timer. Okay, well, I'm gonna go ahead and cut it. Go. Hey guys. Um, so I think that we last left off seeing each other while I was preparing for our Christmas meal, even though it's the 23rd today. Um, but we had Wayne's family over, his mom and dad, to celebrate Christmas. And so um, I cooked some ham and um, mashed potatoes and green bean casserole, um, mac and cheese, and then we had some pies that we ended up forgetting about. <laughs> but um, we left them in the fridge and we, me and Wayne realized that and ate some now. But anyway, after the, his parents came, um, so we celebrated Christmas, we opened up our presents from his parents and they opened up their presents from us. And then we went to a hockey game. So we got to see um, the Columbus Cottonmouths. It's um, a team in Columbus, Georgia. So we got to see them play against the Pensacola Ice Flyers. And it was actually a really, really awesome game. I mean, they supposedly, and I say supposedly because I've only got to see like two games of theirs this season. But supposedly they're really crummy. And I can tell a little bit of that by their play. But both times that we went, they have won this season. So I'm really happy about that. Because both times that we've gone, we've taken other people with us, sort of introducing them to hockey a little bit. Um, the first time it was my little cousins. And then the second time it was um, Wayne's parents. So um, I think they enjoyed themselves, especially since, like, we literally won the game in the last 27 seconds of play. Um, and so it was very, very crazy, you know, very celebratory. But anyway, so we went, um, each time that we've actually gone to the games, we've done, like, a package deal type of thing. So it's, like, four tickets, and then you get, um, like, certain, like, little incentives. So, like, the first time when we went... Um, with my little cousins, it was four tickets for 34 bucks or 30. It, I think it was, it was around 40 bucks once you added in all the taxes and all that. Um, and so with that one, we got the four tickets to a game and it had to be that specific game. So four tickets to the game. 
and then we had four hats and then four Waffle House meals, all for that price. So uh, that was a really awesome deal. This time, uh, we still got a real good deal, um, but this time it was like, I believe, $65. So, you know, almost 70 with taxes and such. So this time the deal was flex tickets, meaning that we could use these four tickets in any way that we wanted to. So we could have, like one of us could have gone to four games or me and Wayne could have went to two games together. But we decided to take his parents, so it was four, four people um, using them all at once. So um, that was the deal. And the deal also came, it was like, it was some type of Santa deal. Co cozy up with Santa. I don't know. Something silly like that. But, it, um, it was Cozy Up with some Russian of sorts names like Kaziev or something like that. Okay. Anyway, it was one of the players. But anyway, so the reason they called it that is because you got this blanket, which is actually like, you know, when you, when, when you do something and they say you're getting a free blanket, you sort of are expecting just like one of those little, like, felt like super thin blankets, you know, maybe with like a little logo in the corner. But this is actually like a really large blanket that's very thick. It's actually like hoodie material. It feels like a hoodie would. And then it's got um, a big logo here in the middle that says property of cotton mouse hockey. So we were pretty impressed with the blanket alone. And it also came with a, um, a signed picture of one of the players, he's apparently one of the alternates because he's got an A there, number 10. I'm not really familiar with the team yet because, like I said, we've only gone to two games. So, the more games we go to, the more I'll actually get into who the players are exactly and that type of thing. But anyway, I thought it was a really good deal. Um, so, yeah, so um, that's pretty much been our day, you know, um, cooking and then sort of like, you know, just preparing the house for... Um, parents arrival and then go into the game with them so um, it's been a pretty fun day it's also been a very long day too so but we're really excited for Christmas now Wayne was wanting us he's like you know it's almost Christmas Eve we could go ahead and open up our Christmas Eve gifts uh, because it's I believe 11 something now maybe even might even be it's 11 36 yeah, 11 36 so he was like we could go ahead and open up our gifts for uh, our Christmas Eve gifts because um, in his family and in mine, we both have the tradition of opening him one Christmas present on Christmas Eve. So that's something that we're going to keep with each other since both of our families did that growing up. But um, I said, no, we're going to wait till tomorrow to do it. But we did already pick out the presents that we're going to, um, that we're going to open up tomorrow. So I'm sure that we'll, you'll get to see that. Um, Anyway, that's pretty much been our day. Wayne, do you want to add anything? We got a grill. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we can talk about the stuff that your parents got us. Yeah, we got a grill. We got, uh, and that was really surprising me. I thought it was a joke at first. Like, so I really did not have the correct reaction because they were bringing us um, a table that Wayne inherited from his grandfather or great-grandfather? Great. Great-grandfather. So they're bringing the table so Wayne's dad has him go out back to help him get it out. And um, and there was a grill in the back. And Wayne's like, where's the table at? And so Wayne didn't realize that it that they were that they weren't joking too. And they're like, No, that's one of your Christmas presents. And he sort of said it laughing. So I was like, ha, ha, ha. And so I feel like I had the complete wrong reaction because that's really crazy that they got us a grill. I mean, grill the propane tank to go with it, and then also the grill stuff to go with it. We also got a um, crock pot, which we'd really been needing and wanting. Um, I got a new purse that's super cute. It's got little owls all over it. And it's one of those, it's Lily Bloom. I don't know if you've ever heard of that company before, but it's a popular purse company. And then I also got some more silverware. For, um, that matches the silverware that we have. And, oh, we've got a floor mat that's um, owls. That's like a welcome, a welcome mat. Um, 
And then Wayne got some tools and stuff. So he got like some drill bit stuff and like a little tool kit. Um, because uh, moving in together, I actually had more tools than he did. So. I'll just have this little side note. Um, most of my tools were already in, like in boxes well hidden. And in going through those boxes, we've been finding some tools and there's still some boxes to go yeah. through. So We've been the finding some bits. The problem is, I, her tools were all together, and my tools have been scattered for the last six months, so my tools have not been exactly useful. Right. So, in many ways, yeah, she's had those tools at our disposal, whereas we didn't have to buy any. And now I'm saying, okay, well, these are the projects that we're looking at, and I'm going to need these tools, so this is a great opportunity to go ahead and maybe get some tools out of um, some other people. Mm -hmm. So, trying to set myself up for uh, less of a Lowe's bill after I start some of these projects. Yeah. So, um, anyway, so what did... Oh, he also got gift card to get some fish and stuff. Mm -hmm. And I think that was... I think I covered everything. That's basically it. Yeah. So, um, oh, and I also got some little owl bookmarks too that were with the purse. So, um, yeah, so we had a good time and we enjoyed getting to have some company over here for a change. And now that we got the table, we can actually entertain more too. So it's a little bit more open up for having more people over because before it was just a little, that card table I think y'all saw in the house store. Um, that we used for our regular dining room table and that did not work out too well. So it's nice to have a legitimate table. <laughs> anyway, um, that's all for now, I guess. And I, I hope that I will see y'all or catch y'all tomorrow whenever we open up our presents and do some other Christmassy stuff. Bye for now.